Hey everyone, it's me, Stacey Nicole here with Hesna Scripts. I'm back with another haul. Um, my order came in uh, from a D stash haul. I ordered from Tina's Crafty Creations, I believe is her YouTube. And um, I also had to go to Hobby Lobby. This is a huge haul, so buckle up and get ready because it's going to be a long haul. I have a ton of stuff. Um, crazy. So I went to Hobby Lobby. I was proud of myself. I went and buy the scrapbooking stuff for one thing. Didn't buy any stickers, didn't buy any ephemera, got non scrapbooky things. I actually went there um, with a purpose, but I'll explain that in a minute. I found this, it's just going through the odd aisles. Um, they are cork tiles, and they actually have um, the uh, mounting tape included. I uh, collect. Um, pest dispensers. I was collecting ones that I thought might be worth something. I used to collect pest dispensers a long time ago. Um, and when I left my husband at the time, he um, got everything. I left with literally a suitcase worth of clothes. And they got everything. So it is what it is. And it worked out that way. It just wasn't a good relationship. A lot of bad stuff happening. So it was a good thing for me to just leave at the time. So I'm starting to collect pest dispensers again. I love them. I just collect ones that I really like or I think that might be worth money one day. Um, like I have a, I'm not a LeBron James fan. Um, my stepson is. I'm not a big basketball person but I got some LeBron James ones. Um, for the from the space camp or space jam or what space camp space jam um, and stuff like that so I, I would like to put them up on a wall um, I have paneling in my scrap room and it doesn't go well with nails so if I could put these up and use um, push bins that would be great so I got that that was only $9.99 I also found these kind of wander in the aisles. Um, these are portfolio uh, poly zip envelopes for $2.49. It's got a pocket in front. It's got a zip pocket in here. It extends pretty well. Right now I have some, um, let me get one just a second. These are my card kits right now and I have them in a 12, uh, not 12 by 12, about an 8 and a half by 11 gallon size bag. So I was thinking if I could put it in there and organize it a little bit better, it'd be nice. That was my goal anyway. So I did get three of those. They actually had a larger size one too, but I didn't think it would work for my Project Live because I do use 12 by 12 stuff sometimes. So it wouldn't fit. This is the one thing I went into the scrapbooking section for card storage bags. They only had two, so I grabbed what they had. They're only $1.49, and you get 20 of them, which isn't a bad price, actually. Okay, this is why I went to Hobby Lobby. So, the, <laughs> where do I even start? So, um, the color, um, watercolor crowns that I had didn't go well and um yeah it just didn't go well and so i don't know if it was the paper i was using technically wasn't watercolor paper so i did pick some of that up i picked up this um was it eight by eight uh it's a centimeter so i have no idea let's look let's look on my thing yeah it's eight by eight and I picked up this watercolor to give it a second try to see maybe it would blend better with um, regular watercolor paper. My issue was that the lines were showing where you drew, and I didn't like that. But I decided to go ahead and get these color pencils. I only got this size, the 24 color, the 50 something color was like $60, $70. And in all honesty, this one had, oh, smacking my camera stand again. This one had a lot of variants of colors, like three different purples. I, I didn't like that it only had two blues when it has like four greens. But it did, you know, we'll give it a try. See how, see how it goes. I also got some Gamsol to go with that as well as some blending stumps. 
I couldn't find the sandy, the sand thing that you scratch these on to clean them. So I went ahead and just got two packs for now. Give it a try. Now let me move all that stuff out of my way because this haul is crazy. So, like I said, I was on YouTube. Let me look here. I have my phone out here. I think it's Tina Creations. Yeah. Here it is. Um, Tina um, Tina's underscore craft underscore creations. I, I was subscribed to her and I saw the D-stash. And I jumped on it. It was $50 shipped. It was a medium flat rate box, which was stuffed. And then the shipping was like $17.50. So I bought the Jen Hatfield box one and the Jen Hatfield box two. And let me tell you, oh my God. It is, and it's not all Jen Hatfield. There's a couple other things, but it's mostly Jen Hatfield. I don't even know, in all honesty, where to start because there's so much stuff. So... I'm just going to grab some of these ephemera packs and we'll go through them. Um, this is the homemade, Jen Happle homemade. No, that's not right. This is family. So you get that ephemera pack. I real, I don't think I've ever had this ephemera pack. I've had had this one. This is the Chasing Adventures. Don't mind having a second one. That's for sure. This stuff will tie me over for a long time with everything else that I have so I can stay away from scrapbook shopping. That's the goal. I still have one more order coming from Honeybee Stamps. I've been waiting on. They have COVID, and their shop is um, lowly staffed right now. So it's. Just, I ordered over a month ago. Still haven't got it. But we'll see. This one is also. This is family. Is that the same one as this? So it looks like we get two of these. Why do they look so different, but they're the same on the back? Why does that one look like? Okay. Just a second. My mind's working here. I don't even know if this is what's supposed to be in here. Because that little house right there, that little house, I'm not seeing anywhere. And this circle with the flowers... I see that flower, but that's not that one. I think they put the wrong stuff in here or something. I'm not sure. It looks nothing like nothing at all. Well, there's a the little girls. Yeah, this is this this says this is family, but do you see these little girls dancing in that house? That's not on here. So I have no idea what line that's from. But it looks like we got two of them. Oh, here we go. This is why. Okay, so this is showing, <laughs> this is confusing and crazy. This is showing this one, but technically it's this one. And I have two of those. Okay, mystery solved. <laughs> mystery solved, okay. Um, also got uh, these journal cards um, or tags. Really cute. I like the hello. I like the thinking of you and the celebrate. These will be make easy cards. Easy cards. Um, got one, two, three, four of these, which is kind of cool. Um, so let's do a giveaway if you're paying attention. Um, I have three of extra of these to send out so comment below your favorite thing out of these d-stash bags or boxes and and that way i know you're paying attention i am going to advertise that this is giveaway i know two people will pay attention to this kathy and gina but that's probably the only people who pay attention oh look i have five so we have four to give away so if you're paying attention again just comment below what your favorite thing in these d-stash kits are or bags or boxes whatever the heck they are got two of these sticker sheets i'm not 100 percent sure what that line is but i it kind of looks let me check something it kind of looks like that one line back here the uh, this is family uh, this is family line possibly i don't know it's really cute though you get two of them i like the taco really cute 
too cute. Okay. Also got a paper pad. And some of these are used. This one is brand new. Let me open it. I think the other one's used. Maybe. Maybe I can open it. Okay, there's that side. One side down. Okay. So you got the This Is Family. I've never had this collection, so that's kind of cool. Um, really cute papers. I love the pinks. I like that paper right there. These are cool. They're cut apart. It says, have a great day. Thinking of you. You make me smile. Hello. I like the picnic basket one, too. It's cute. Cute. Okay, so there's that one. Um, this uh, paper pie came with it. It doesn't look like if it was used. Not much of it was used. It looks like only one side was open. So, assuming it's not used at all. Just a second. Maybe. Now, I have had this paper pad before. I recognize one of the things on there. It was a long time ago, but I've had this paper pad. Because I recognize this. Because I remember. And I recognize that. So, I've had this before. Don't mind having it again. Really cute paper pad. Now, the stuff I just showed you is probably worth the 30 something dollars. Um, because in all honesty, she paid $17.50 in shipping. And then, yeah. She had a used, um, ephemera here that she put in a little bag. Yeah, I like how she stores her ephemera, her extra ephemera. She'll cut the back off and then she'll put that with ephemera. That's kind of cool. Got these fun stickers. I like those. Those are cool with the wood grain. And then this is a Jen Hatfield sticker book that she had parts of left. It looks like pretty much all of it's untouched. Maybe a couple of them that she didn't touch. Um, this might be the This Is Family collection as well. I'm not 100% sure. It's cute. All kinds of fun stuff. I really like how she stores all her stuff. She has it all in plastic and keeps it all nice and tidy. Like she takes apart the the sticker book and she usually keeps parts of the collection. If I can put it back in there, that is. That's half the battle, I'll tell you. There we go. And she has it labeled, which is cool. Um, this is the non Jen Hatfield stuff, but it kind of goes with the colors. Um, Simple Stories Spring Farmhouse bows. And then she got me some Heidi Swap goodies also, which I'm excited about. Not sure which collection this is. Heidi Swap doesn't put her collection on here, which is kind of sucky. It's a scrapbook.com. It's exclusive to scrapbook.com. So it's something I never had, that's for sure. I used to shop through scrapbook.com. Lately, I've been shopping the cherry on top. Another scrapbook.com exclusive. This is gorgeous. I love that blue color and that teal turquoise. That's gorgeous. Ooh, that makes me happy on the back, too. Oh, my gosh. So much stuff. This is... I'm not even close to being done with box one. This is crazy. Um, yeah, and more Jen Hatfield stickers. Loving these. I think I've had these because I remember that. Yeah, I've had these. I remember that as well. You know, I may have um, uh, the digitals of this collection. It looks really familiar. Another paper pad unused. It's crazy. This one's heart, heart home, heart, heart home. There we go. Get it. There we go. Now I got the sticky off. I love the pinks and greens. I like that paper. That looks really familiar. I don't think I've had this though. But that paper looked familiar. Okay, I got a sticker book. Um, this one is from the This Is Family. Kind of a look at that. You got these random people, which I honestly probably won't use. They're cool. Could maybe make a card with them or something. Got some birthday stuff there and randomness. Got some gold foiling, words, 
and the houses and then um just randomness i like this tree so i have been stacking this stuff in a pile because i have no idea where to put it okay it looks like i got two of these um this is from what collection doesn't say doesn't say but i think i've had this collection it looks familiar this is the heart in home one too uh, really cute really pretty there's the back and there's the front it's really pretty okay here's another one that she had <laughs> stacked all in a baggie together this is the whole along the way collection i'm going to pull it out piece by piece here and see what we got um so again this is all along the way i've had this sticker sheet because i remember that little girl i think i put her on a card before it's really cute and there's the back got the ephemera let's see looks like we got some wood veneer those are cute those are too cute Oh my gosh, there's so much stuff, guys. Oh my gosh. Um, got the uh, Brad, not Brad's, like adhesive Brad's in the enamel dot kind of embellishment pack. That's really cute. I like that. Thanks. Uh, random wood veneer. Some dimensional stickers. Those are cute. Um, looks like we got another ephemera pack and another one of those embellishments too now the rest is paper looks like you get a cut apart oh not just paper you get a cut apart sheet oh my goodness gracious she's got so much stuff in here this is crazy just a second <laughs> i can't believe i got this i i can't believe she sold this so stinking cheap first and foremost it's crazy um, this was the along the way uh, paper pad. I try to flip through it here, but it's kind of hard with my camera stand being in the way. Really cute. You get not only one of these chipboards, you get two, which is cool. So there's that. And then you also get that cut apart sheet, which I really like. I don't think I've ever gotten this. That's really cute. I love the thank you. I love the happy birthday. I love this one too, just for you. That's really cute. Okay, a few more things, and then we're done with box one. Don't ask me where I'm going to put box two. Oh my gosh. Um, Jen Hatfield Project Pad. Uh, this is family. It's brand new. Hasn't been used. Um, it's got glitter paper. It's got stickers. Let me go ahead and open this. Maybe. Maybe, maybe. Aha, one side. Sorry, I'm smacking my camera again. There's just no room in my scrap room right now. Okay. So you get like some boards you can cut out. It's a really cute paper pad. Some glitter paper, some foil paper as well. More foil paper. A cut apart. It's really cute. Some words and that sticker sheet. Which I think we have that sticker sheet. We had two of that sticker sheet. Pretty sure. Okay, couple more things. Last things. Okay. Got some cut aparts here. That's really cute. This is um from This Is Family. Got some papers and sheets as well from the This Is Family. Another cut apart. I mean, she just got everything. I'll tell you what. That's just amazing. I like that paper. And then, last thing I got for box one is this um, chipboard. I totally scored. <laughs> and my battery's dying, so we're going to do box two on a different uh, video. I figured it would because this is crazy amount of stuff. But... <sighs> totally scored on this thank you tina thank you if you're watching this i'm so stinking excited all right guys i'll hopefully get to record uh round two next <laughs>